Hey guys, welcome back to some more FTL. Uh, we have a nebula up here which we will want to explore and I can get all the way over there if I want to. That's kind of nice. So there's no ships near me to kill right away so I guess I'll just go over here. Uh, well, what, what do I know? There's an unmade scout pursuing a civilian ship. Let's go aid him. Charging weapons. Alright. This guy has a fair bit of weapons here but um, nothing a little bit of zeal Mike Lett. Uh, combo one-two punch can't do. Okay, so I fired that off and then I can do this. So it only lowers my cloak a little bit, so it's, I'm not too bad off. I figured that would do that. You want to cloak before things hit, and it's when they enter your screen when, is when they'll hit. And they, both of the shots missed. This is one of the problems, because you need to lower the shields, and it gets really painful when they have like lots of shields, so... Having something... Are you joking me? Having something that takes down shields fast is actually probably one of your best options. But to be honest, this ship is actually rather flexible. Yeah, you hit it anyways. Constantly missing. And why did I cloak? I don't even know. Okay, well, I, I, I can last without oxygen for a little while, so I'm okay. I, I guess I was just bad manner cloaking. I'm gonna hit that. I was hoping that I'd be able to hit his um, cockpit so that my next shot would hit no matter what, but whatever. That, that is one of the things you can do, but um, my, my, my interest is purely in taking your shields down. There you go, now he's dead. Ah, uh, he hates it, breaks apart. I hastened to contact the civilian ship and he retreated like a jerk, so whatever. Fuck off. I don't need your, I don't need your shit anyways. What happens? Like, no good deed goes unpunished in FDL. That's how it works. Okay, uh, so I have a bit of scrap here, and also there's a ship there. Uh, let's see, what can I go get? I want to get weapons eventually, I really do, uh, but for the time being, yeah. Doors, as I said, I'm still not convinced. Uh, people gave very compelling ar arguments for getting doors, and I still don't think I need it. Uh, cause they're like, well, you could have prevented them from taking damage in some room or something. Ah, it's, I know it's 20 scrap, but man, I know I'm like practically shitting scrap here, but I'm, I'm trying to like save it for when I get to a store or something. Here we go. We upped our evade once again, so it's even higher. Let's hop into the nebula where they will not be able to chase us as, as effectively. Uh, this guy wants to trade H fuel for minus two drill. That's a good deal. I will take that. That's why I didn't get it. Get any fuel at the last uh, trader because I'm just like, why? What's the point? What's in it for me? We'll go over here now. Let's hope that the other nebula isn't actually a place where uh, that there's bad stuff. Yeah, I nervously glance out the side of the windows, and the only thing that greet me is more is clouds and silence. Fuck! There is something there, but I can just go back here. Why would I? Oh, actually, you know, I probably occurred to me. Yeah, there's actually nothing there. Oh, whatever. <laughs> there was no ship there. It was just like it was just gonna power down my stuff. Um, so it's worrying that the rebels have penetrated so deep into uncharted space. Even if you, it's only an unmanned craft uh, in arms weapons, you should do the same. All right. This guy has um, beam weapon. Cloaking immediately. Why risk it? If I had three bars of cloak, um, the thing is, it wouldn't be done by the time my weapons charge. Because you see, right when I'm finished here, there you go. I'm gonna fire. And now I disable all those weapons. That's why I have two bars of cloak, because uh, you don't need any more than that for the time being. Uh, if you get, uh, there is one augmentation, the stealth weapons aug uh, augmentation, which would prevent that downside, as I mentioned before. That would be nice to get. Uh, if I have that, then, oh, well, I'm all for level three cloak, but for the time being, I don't see the point. So I'm not doing it. And it's, this, this ship is kind of odd, because the mini beam charges at a separate time as the other weapon, so whatever. And now we finished him off. That was an easy, easy ship to kill. He didn't even get a single shot off. This is the unfortunate part, and I guess I'm going to be going over here, because I'm not really at risk of being attacked by ship, I think. Guess we'll see. Uh, let's, uh, so there's um, incapacitated ships in the shadows, br briefly illuminated by light lightning. Okay. So I can either manually search for the wreckage for survival and equipment, or I can avoid the risk and jump away unscathed. I'm gonna try and uh, go look around. Uh, most of the debris is hardly usable as scrap. However, you eventually find an intact weapon that can mount on your ship. I now have a whole missile. 
Missile weapon's kind of nice, as you guys know. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be using this one. I'd rather have a, one that targets systems so that my mini beam can do damage. But, you know, sometimes I get through the entire game and I don't actually use the mini beam by the end. Um, it really depends. Uh, and I also probably should have oxygen power. Uh, we'll hop over to this guy over here. Okay, so this one, there's a forward scout rebel and he's powering up FDL. So I'm going to put full power into that. My mini beam goes up. I can, uh, I can have hull missiles if I really want to. This is a beam drone. Uh, this is the thing that I fucking morbidly hate when I play uh, with the, the, the type B style ship because he always manages to kill your fucking weapon system somehow. So I just wait for him before he does the fire and then I just do that. But these guys are assholes. They'll, they have a 100% hit chance to hit and they fire like every two seconds. So if you do not have like at least two bars in cloak, you're, you're fucking dead already. Well, not really dead, but whatever. Okay, so I'm actually going to be hitting the, dr the drone thing because uh, that's, that's the biggest problem for me. Okay, so he unfortunately does have a repair drone. It's gonna be the biggest problem for me here. But, uh, yeah, I see he already powered it up again. And then, hopefully before he fires. Yeah, he did fire, but luckily, I did this. Perfectly fine, I killed him. And so that's it. So, as I said, that's the only way to deal with beam dr drones and, um, uh, unfortunately, if they uh, if he if he manages to take down your weapons, uh, you poor fuck. That's all I have to say. Uh, I could put another point into uh, weapons if I so choose to. I probably should, because I have a lot of scrap. But I'm gonna actually wait on it because um, I'm a risky little bastard that way. A rebel ship should, personally, says the captain. I I would have stuck with the Federation, but I'm a soldier, sir. I'm no, I have no use without a word of fight. Razor razor shields. All right. Um, he has a fair bit of weapons here, so someone's boarding our ship like an asshole. So here, I'm gonna cloak, have this guy attack him. I still want to charge my weapons faster, so I'm just gonna do this. They're just gonna have like their little pissing match, and then I need to bring him back onto evasion. All right, so we're gonna attack his weapons, and I'm gonna attack his shields all the way to his weapon systems, and I started fire. Now, I can bring my guy off this. I don't really feel the need to, just let him have the O2. Unfortunately, his missile now fires. And I got a little bit of a hull breach there. All right. Well, let's attack the weapons. Nice, and he doesn't even have shields up, so I just get to do this. He's apparently gonna power up his FTL. Well, good luck with that. Oh, now you wanna surrender, huh? After, like, the beam just goes into another room. Uh, I don't want any of that. I have no interest in any anything you have. And he's dead, that's it. Okay, so he left behind uh, probably like similar stuff to what he was offering me before, so I'm just gonna go and uh, repair everything. How do I still only have three freaking crew members? Like, I'm d and I'm so far into this game already. Whatevers. All right, well, everyone's good, so let's go heal up everybody because we want to have everyone in pristine condition before we continue out. Uh, you get on that, you get on that, you get on that. So this is the best way I know how of playing this 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 ship, basically. And I, I, I do enjoy it. I have a lot of fun with it, so. Uh, it's an unmade scout, and his, his AI wastes no time in engaging my ship. Uh... I might as well cloak right away. I'm lazy. What can I say? Can you blame me? Yeah, you probably can. Oh well. Alright, so attack his weapon systems. Beam him. Unfortunately one missed, so the other laser's gonna get him. So yeah, I could have negated the fire the damage right there, but I didn't. No, now I regret everything I've ever done. Oh whatever. I probably should have done it on the other side, it just occurred to me. Because if you take out his shields, then he's going to be a sad panda. I wonder, actually. Can you, like, at oh, I could I could attack his cockpit and then his shields. Look at that. I'm a baller. Now, fortunately, he doesn't have any oxygen in his uh, component bays or whatever. He'll repair them on his own, uh, but he has no oxygen there, so he can't uh, uh, 
fires won't do shit, basically. Uh, so the ship explodes, leaving some crap for me. Yeah. All right. Uh, we are not going to go there because I will be with the Federation, and the Federation are not my friends. I would, however, like to go to a store. That sounds like a good idea. Uh, they generic advertisements from a nearby shipyard. They they it seems they are willing to work on any ship, not only those of Rebel Hue. I don't no idea. Stealth weapons. I'll take that. If you read the description here, uh, prevents the weapon fire from dis disrupting your cloak, allow you to shoot while cloaked. Okay, I'm actually gonna get rid of titanium casing. I don't like it. It's not my thing. Uh, I'm gonna go repair up a little bit, and I need nothing else here. Uh, I could get drone control or crew teleporter. I'm not a boarding ship uh, by any means. I I need all my crew where they are, and <laughs> I don't really use drones, so screw that too. I'm getting kind of unlucky in the sense that. Um, I don't have any good weapons, I just have the hull missile, uh, which I would prefer not using because that, that, that's, a, that's two damage and two exit in system, systemless rooms, oh, because I, I prefer to take down systems, because then I can take down shields and I can take down weapons and I can prolong it and all that kind of shit, I, I want, don't want this. But the whole reason I am keeping it though is because I'm a little worried that I'm not going to get anything else for a while. Or like I may meet a ship with that is has too much fucking shields for me to do anything with, so... That is my concern. I'm thinking about investing into it just so I can have it for the time being. Actually, uh, sorry, while I'm here. So I'm not a fucking hypocrite. Full power to cloak. So... Uh, the downside to having to using cloak all the time. Oh, here we go. This is, the, this is what I was worried about. And he's gonna power up his FDL drive. Cloaking. Uh, now you'll notice that I, whenever I fire, I do not actually get the disadvantage, the, the little downside of of the little inconvenience. Unfortunately, I don't. Uh, if he misses at least once, um, then I can't do a thing. It's my last chance, and I'm just gonna jump away. Okay, I'm jumping away after this. You're joking me. This is not charging anymore. He he couldn't have hit me in a better place. Fucking constantly. All right. See you later, squares. Now I don't. I think that the rebel fleet will not be there, but whatever. We'll see. One merchant seems to be mass broadcasting from for, for mercenary ship to aid him. Yeah, we'll respond. Uh. I need to deliver this cargo of drone parts. It's a few jumps away. Alright, sure. He gave me f five drone parts. And I'm gonna... Uh, it's gonna be there, so... I'm, I might as well, since I'm fighting him anyways. Actually, I should have repaired my medbay, it just occurred to me. Not much plant uh, interest nearby, the small stun, a distance with a few orbiting planets nearby. Okay, well, there's nothing here. Which means now I'll just go repair everything. Should go repair that. This is, this is the most important thing to me. It's sensors. No, not really. As I said, I can see the internals, I can see what their people are doing, but it doesn't really change much. Like, I'm just not like, I'm like, oh, I won't target that then. I don't know, I don't really, I don't really see the point. Okay, so this is so far actually a very unlucky run, believe it or not. I haven't gotten anywhere where I can get, like, decent weapons, so, I don't know. Uh, gonna cloak. My main goal here is to charge up FTL Drive and get the fuck out of here. I, I mean, I'll try and hurt him, but I, I doubt I'll be able to do... Oh, look, uh, I got through his thing. Yay, fires! I took down one of his things. I love cloaking. And I took down another one of his things. Yeah, maybe I will just stay here. Sounds like a terrible idea, but... Ah, uh, well, I'm already committed. Oh, look, it, look everything missed. Look at that free one fuel, guys! Now, I, I'm pretty sure you maybe can hit... Like, uh, here, let me actually show you what I mean. Um, I think you can hit, like, four rooms if you angle this correctly. I don't really bother with that, because it's just... It's too unstable for me, and I'll sometimes miss, and I, I don't want to miss the weapons bay, at the very least, so... Yeah, one fuel. Yeah. One fuel for free. So, there's either Zoltans or Uncharted Nebula. Nebula. Because I don't want to deal with Zoltan shields, I'm sorry. 
Okay, we're in thick nebula. So unfortunately, they are not slowed down when they're in here. Uh, that sucks for me, I guess. Hey, look, it's a, it's an asshole. Guess I might as well wait for him to fire since I have like three bars of cloak that don't bot don't I don't have to worry about. Yeah, you missed. Y'all missed, pal. All right. So we'll hit him in the, the the whatever the hell this thing is. There we go. Unfortunately, he still has his beam weapon. That would have been the one goddamn thing I want to take out. Fucking asshole. There we go. And luckily, he didn't fire it again. Does he notice I'm like in sector th three or four or something, and I still don't have shields. And I got a bunch of shit for that. I just don't feel the need to have shields right now. It's just, I've been doing fine without them, so. Uh, nebulas are known to be a populous mantis hunting grounds. Uh, information will, whatever, okay. Uh, they're unfortunately gonna board me, so I'm gonna cloak. One of the things I can do is I can target his, um, uh, his transporter system after I tra target the weapons, of course. Uh, well, actually, yeah, like kind of like this. So hopefully, it has only one bar. Having another point in sensors would actually help determine that, but whatever. No, unfortunately, not. He'll be able to board uh, after I finish my cloak, of course. Wow, I, I actually hurt him a little bit. This is the unfortunate part. I may have to bail. Um, I'm gonna hope that I can... There we go. I don't actually want to prevent him from getting off my ship, so I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna hope that he gets off. And I'm still gonna hit the four rooms, like before. Alright, get the hell up. No, no! Oh, what the hell. Oh god. Okay! Uh, this is gonna be interesting. This guy is really heavily wounded. <laughs> I yeah I got five health I don't think I'll be able to survive a single hit okay leave 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 doesn't matter fortunately my my shit's not powered anymore that's a that's a 100% chance hit please oh god don't shoot there no no oh god no 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 get, get out of there all right all right, all right. <laughs> I am literally on the edge of my seat right now. Did they just leave? And they explode and all that kind of shit. Okay. Actually, let's start venting atmosphere from everywhere. But here in just a moment. They're attacking my weapon systems right now. Okay. Okay, well, no, no, I don't want to vent it from ever- Oh, wait, I don't have oxygen anymore. Fuck. Uh, that's not good. Actually, I don't want to do that. Let's heal up and kill these guys. You go get the oxygen. Oh, wow, actually, one of them got transported away. You can go help here. Fuck. Alright, so, you guys all for a 10 minute breather on, uh, on repairing the ship? Yeah, let's get this ship repaired. That was a close one. I almost, uh, I almost died myself. Mike Latt never dies. Mike Latt's fucking hanging on by the edge of his seat. Or wait, I, I don't know. There's, there's a phrase for phrase for that. Hang on by the, the, something about a hair, or a thread or something. God, someone will tell me. All right. Go repair up to full. Which will get your ass in the engine room. We can do get your ass on engines. And Mike Latt, go st stand here and heal. You sexy babe. Yeah. Okay. All right, and that's it, mini beam. And the store here, let's go to the store. So um, there's a couple of options they have here. Uh, so it's, it's not a very usual place for a store, but the uh, NGO aren't a usual species, wouldn't hurt to take a look. Fuck, still nothing here. They're not even selling me shields, for God's sake. <sighs> All right, I'm gonna put more power into weapons. I don't have a choice. Love God. Um, I have to jump back down because I need to go take the bottom route. Actually, there is a thing here. What what is here, anyways? It's an ion storm. Okay. I'm gonna risk it. 
because I'm thinking to myself right now and I want to get that quest and then I'm just going to go all the way around. I won't be able to get the quest and that. So I think the rewards will be much higher. I, it's an ion storm. It's not like something that's going to actually damage me. So he's got his stuff. So I'm going to charge up this stuff, that stuff. Uh, I can have oxygen powered for now. Cloaking. I love cloak. Don't you guys love cloak? I fucking love cloak. Alright, and you fire at that. And then do this. Fortunately, he still has one thing of weapons. However, given my charge, given the fact I have three bars, I think I'll be able to fire once more before... before he can fire. And I can. I'm completely a cheap ass. Look at me go, bomb. Alright, let's hit that. Oh, you wanna offer me three drones, one drone one one drone part and four screen scrap? No, you die. That's what did you get from inconvenience me making make, make him go through this stupid ass thing? Alright, let's jump out of here. The quest. And uh, I'm supposed to deliver drone parts to the station. I find a small research station and discover that it's putting out a distress signal. Okay, I'll dock with the station and investigate, sure. Uh, as you explore the base, crazy screams are heard. Your team retreats back to the ship with a <laughs> number of armed scientists in pursuit. One of your team starts to cough and falls into spasm on the floor. Beg him. Oh, God. Being back aboard, your injured friend rises up and starts attacking you, screaming. Caught off guard, your remaining crew falls back. Oh, fuck! So <laughs> well, that was an event I really couldn't do much with. Fucking hell. Yeah, this is my worst run. There's four of them. I got, I got, I gotta attack him. I gotta go to a store and I, I gotta buy a new guy. A little power, full power to the engines. Yeah, you can go attack that, I don't really care. Uh, I don't even know why I'm doing this. Let the oxygen kind of go in the rest of the ship. They're not going to go anywhere. They're just going to chill right here. Who did I lose? Oh, I lost Witchell, of course. A fucking asshole, probably. Like he 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 just wanted to get sick. One asswipe. This is this is the problem. If 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 you if you name one of your characters after Jack, you just might as well expect him to fail. Fuck. Well, what you do, it's just up to me and you now. Co-op buddies for life. Alright. Um, first first place I can go and stop by and get an extra crew member, I'm going to do that. No attack comes. Alright. Fortunately, I now have a suffer... Look, I don't have nearly as much evade as I used to. Our automated rebel scrout was positioned to Nebula, warned to your passing. He's powering his FDL drive. Oh, well, I, I have no reason to cloak. Actually, I'm going to go and put power into the hull missile. Just and this is the, this guy is a major fucking issue. Cuz um unfortunately, if he engines away from me, so I'm going to hit him like this. I got to hit him. I got to prevent his I I think that maybe the cockpit prevents the maybe it does. Oh well, I wouldn't know. I think someone was telling me that it that actually happens that like the hitting the cockpit will prevent them from jumping into FTL, but I don't think that's the case for automated drones. I don't know. I'm not gonna pretend to know. So the ship breaks apart, I'm still one step ahead. Okay. Well we'll hop down here. No no other choice but to go down there. Uh sensor uh with sensors down, you spend a great deal of time staring out the window. You must admit it's rather beautiful here. It's fucking pink clouds. Pink fluffy clouds. It's nothing beautiful about this. Alright, so there's a ship nearby, and he's stationed to look for me, apparently. So I can either attack the ship, uh, attempt to remain concealed, or stay hidden. Uh, if I if I stay hidden, that means I don't I don't attack him. I'd rather attack him. That's the whole reason I came here. So since Jack is dead, I might as well wait for him to fire so he wastes off waste a shot. I don't like the Okay, good. 
Oh, hit my fucking that thing. Great. I should have cloaked. Should have cloaked. Whatever. Get my one thing of cloak. I'm gonna haul missile that. Okay, and hopefully he'll do this. That's why I hauled missiled. That's that's a good thing for me. I kind of don't want him to shoot me anymore, but I may not have a choice. No, I will not. I know my engines are hit. What a tragedy. Yeah, you can try and escape. These FTLs delayed though, so we're okay. We're in good shape still. Except for the fact we're fucking missing a crew member and that I have no doors. Which means I can't vent the atmosphere and I'd rather keep... I'd rather kill this guy before I, uh... We're gonna have to spend a couple minutes repairing the ship. No, no, you fucking inconvenienced me. I'm gonna kill you and you give me more scrap. Alright. First go, go repair that door. Yeah, they're burning my engines out. Fortunately, I'm gonna take a damage from that because it's like completely there. Okay, that's, yeah, that's it. That took one piece of damage, and I also I, I heard a hull breach here. It's always unfortunate when this happens. Oh well, <laughs> I have so many points in fucking engines, and I just I didn't get to even use it. Haha, bad manner cloak. Well, that's that's all done with. Well then, what did we learn? This is a really finicky ship, and it is it is a little bit based... Like, the game is a bit based on luck, and I've actually been getting really unlucky during this run, so... That's why I have the whole missile, I'm just trying to make the best of use of what I can, and... Uh, and I'm starting to lose hull integrity, so... Uh, I may not last for much longer, we'll have to see. Are you on the edge of your seat yet, guys? I certainly am. You know, those doors are looking more appealing now, to be honest. But the, to be fair, I'm actually going to save up for a crew member. I just need one guy. Like, the, the, I don't have any other reason. Like, usually by now I get another crew member, so like, losing one wasn't, wouldn't be a big deal. I didn't actually know that, like, the station didn't give me much of a choice, I think. Like, I kind of just went there, I'm like, hey, fuck, it's a quest, I'll get it. The reward will obviously fucking be better than, than, like, not going there. Than, like, what happens? The game, the game fucks me. Whatever. Well, what do we have here? So if I go down there, I'm not going to be able to come back. If I go down here, then yeah, whatever, we'll go down here. And what do we have? There's an... Oh, fucking hell. Cloaking. Okay, so there's an automated drone with three shields protecting something. And so I salvaged everything possible. Missiles, drone parts, scrap. So I got past them. I, I'd, I'd like to kill everything, but this game is not giving me a whole lot of that kind of option. And there's nothing here. Okay. Well... To the exit. Uh, and we're charged and we're ready to go to the next sector. So the next sector will be Zoltan controlled. Unfortunately, because now they have the fucking Zoltan shields. Uh, I cannot get more shit luck in this. Oh well, I'll be seeing you guys next time. Bye.